future of a Jefferson County animal shelter is uncertain tonight. Rockin' Easy Rescue Ranch is contracted through the county to take strays and animals recovered from neglect and abuse cases. That contract expires this year. Colby Ennebrad explains what, happen, what happens, I should say, if it's not renewed. Just those animals we're required to bring in for the county is costing us $35,000 a month. And the county's paying us 20000 So what Rock and Easy has done is basically assumed the risk and liability to come up with $15,000 a month to take care of dogs that the county should be responsible for. Over the last six months, Rock and Easy Rescue Ranch in Madras has taken in an average of 36 dogs a month. And that means that we have to bring them in for no less than, for the police, 10 days, for strays, 5 days. And... We have to make sure that they all have their shots, that they all see a vet, that uh, they get any medical treatment that they need, that they get spayed or neutered before they go back out there. So it's a big expense. The shelter wants to extend its contract from one year to five years, with an increase in pay from $240,000 a year to $300,000 a year. Somehow it, it flipped where we're asking for bailout, and we came and bailed them out last year and would like to continue as we've started this on a trajectory to succeed after where it was before. And um, there doesn't seem to be much interest in that. They don't want to pay the, out that kind of money. The ranch's contract with the county is set to expire this year. Without a contract extension that can cover operating costs, the shelter will permanently shut down. Costs have gone way up. Um, animals are not being adopted. The population of animals is huge, and there's not enough homes for the animals. And um, the direction for a high kill shelter, that's just not even an acceptable um, thing, especially in Oregon. In Madras, Colby Innebrad, the Central Oregon Daily News. I did speak with uh, Jefferson County Commissioner Kelly Simmeling tonight. He insists the county needs and will have a shelter. The two sides are still in negotiations, but he adds that shelter may not be able to provide the services that some may want, but it will provide the services the county needs.